I think once they'd caught uh, the individual leader as well, Ballasted, then there wasn't that much time left to uh, keep winding things up. Um, let's look back at the race, though, as a whole. Once our two leaders, long-term leaders, had been caught, we were then served up by this um, double Stockman, both Stockman brothers in the breakaway, including Michael, who'd been out there since the start. And the two riders from uh, Sakaya BB Pro Team in the green and black, Azadov and Osgur. Azadov taking the time out to, uh, to send a salute to the people of Ukraine. And just before Osgur took the uh, treasured of Turkey sprint, he would go on to survive to be the penultimate man to be caught of that breakaway. And it was a breakaway that was being um, <clears throat> steadily, steadily, calmly chased down. The first of the Stockman brothers back in. Uh, oh, no, sorry, the last of them. That was Michael Stockman leaving just two riders clear at that stage then. Ballasted and uh, Osgur. And this is the point at which Maurice Ballasted, the German rider for the Belgian Alperson Fenix team, decided to press on by himself and did the <laughs> classic pro thing there, modern pro thing, of pressing his reset button on his average watts. <laughs> Minute, minute he saw it was clear, he looked straight down and pressed it. This was the final lead out from Jesper de Bust. It looked like Caleb Ewan was just in the perfect position, but as you say, Brian, he's opened up his sprint and not quite had enough speed. Philipson come off his wheel, and Wellsford, a seated drive. He didn't get out the, oh, he didn't get out the cell till now. He'd seated the drive past Philipson and just opened up out the saddle for the last little bit. Now, that is hard to do, isn't it? If, um, if you're watching and you're uh, an amateur, pro, beginner, whatever, bike rider, Try this, once you're up to speed, then get out the saddle and try and accelerate out of the saddle for the last bit. That's a sign of a pure sprinter. And there is the provisional stage classification. Sam Wellsford of Australia and Team DSM taking the win ahead of Jasper Philipson. Arvind de Klein, it was the Dutchman for Human Powered Health. Then Rick Zabel again, another fourth place in this race for him. Itmar Einhorn was the Israeli rider for Israel Premier Tech. Dan McClay, the British rider for Arkea in sixth. Caleb Ewan in the end finishing seventh having taken a win already in this race here's a preview of some of the things we have upcoming for you of course don't